In Montessori, we don't use the names of the letters. Instead, we use the sounds. We don't call this A, B, C in class. We call this A, B, K. And our reason is simple. When your child looks at a book, your child will not say the names of the letters as your child reads. Your child will say the sounds of the letters. So if you think about it, learning the names of the letters is completely superfluous, especially for a preschool child. So we just don't go there. A lot of the children have questions because they've heard this called A before, although in general, they're usually looking at the capital letters. And if you think about it, when you read a book, how many capital letters do you see? So we don't teach the capital letter letters either. When a child is confused because they think this is A, and now I'm calling it A, I simply tell the child that every letter has both a name and a sound, and that at school, we always use the sound. And this seems to satisfy most children, and then we go on only talking about the sounds. You will also notice that the A is blue, and the B and the K are pink. Our reason for this is that we put all of the consonants in pink and all of the vowels in blue. And we don't really need to explain this to the child. They just know that whenever they see the A, it's blue. And to simplify things, when we're teaching the sounds for the vowels, we always begin with the short vowel sound. So, a, e, i, a, and a. And we only give the child one name or sound for each of the blue letters. As they progress forward, they get more information as they're learning to read, but it's just not important in the beginning. So I have a challenge for you as parents, and I know that you can do this because it isn't as hard as you think, but instead of singing the ABC song, sing the ABC song. Why sing the song with the names of the letters when you can sing the song with the sounds of the letters?